what is regenerative agriculture? Regenerative agriculture, there's basically three main principles behind regenerative agriculture. One is to move the soil as little as you can. Secondly, it is to have something growing in the soil basically 364 days a year. Okay. And the third option is to have a diverse crop rotation. So if we talk about those in a little bit more detail, by moving the soil as little as we can, that will improve the soil health. It reduces the amount of carbon dioxide that is uh, comes up into the atmosphere, it reduces the amount of nitrous oxide that goes up in the atmosphere and basically improves, uh, goes a long way towards improving the soil health because the soil will naturally sort itself out. Whereas under the conventional system, you are destroying the soil structure each time that you cultivate it and then it has to put itself back together, all of which takes time. By having something growing in the soil, every ideally every day of the year, that actually, uh, again, improves soil health. It actually allows uh, carbon to be sequestered back into the soil, improves the organic matter status of the soil, improves the soil biology. And that is something that we can talk about a bit more in terms of how that benefits um, reductions in inputs further down the line. And then the third option is um, having a diverse rotation and that basically allows the soil or the, the root systems in the soil will be at varying depths which again will actually help uh, improve the soil health, improve the actual utilizing, utilization of nutrients throughout the soil um, and end up with a more healthy soil all around. That's the, that's the whole aim of regenerative farming is to end up with a more healthy soil. 